Today we are doing a Mother's Day gift guide. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole and on this channel we do everything from parenting tips and tricks to product reviews and much more. So if you are new here, definitely consider subscribing. Today I'm gonna walk you guys through a Mother's Day gift guide. This is something you could share with a spouse who may be looking for gift inspiration, but these are some things that I've received as gifts that I love, um, and so I thought I'd share them with you guys today. So let's go ahead and jump right in. The first thing I wanted to mention was the Fitbit Alta. That is what I have on my wrist right here. It is a fitness tracker, and it is so much more than that. So not only is it keeping track of my steps, but I can use it as a watch, my text messages and other notifications from my phone actually appear on here, and I absolutely love it. I have it in the purple color, and it, mine is also in the size small. Um, it is water resistant, so you can shower with it on. Another thing that's great about the Fitbit Alta is you can pair with your spouse or your friends, and you can help motivate each other. It's just a really cool way to not only keep track of your fitness, but also in a really cool kind of social way. I will leave um, everything that I mentioned in the video definitely linked in the description box down below so that you can click on it and take a closer look. But I've been absolutely loving this. The next thing I wanna mention is a t-shirt and it's the one that I'm wearing. My dear friend Stephanie over at the Texas Unicorn is a t-shirt shop and I am obsessed with this t-shirt. It says, my kids are my cardio. I love it. Um, I love that it is in a v-neck because I wear a lot of really small dainty jewelry and I think it's great that it's in a v. But um, I am wearing the size medium and let's be real, my kids are my cardio. I don't know if you're like me but I actually hate working out so um, this shirt is totally appropriate for me. And if you guys actually purchase the shirt by Friday at midnight, I believe, um, I'm going to actually put a discount code in the description box so you can get 10% off of your order. Um, I'm not being paid for it at all. I purchased this shirt myself. <laughs> and so um, I definitely thought it was really generous of her to give my viewers a discount code. So yeah, definitely enjoy it. This has been a favorite of mine. The shirt itself is soft, it's comfortable, and I love it. The next item that I want to mention is jewelry related. Um, I have been absolutely loving this necklace. You've probably seen it in a bunch of my videos. I will insert a close-up image, but it is a little tiny disc necklace made by a company called Made by Mary. And they're little discs that have a lowercase t and a lowercase j um, for my kids' initials. And I think it's just a super cute way um, to have something like dainty and sweet, but also have something that is meaningful, especially on Mother's Day. So I've definitely been loving this. She makes them in three different colors. This is the rose gold one. Um, they come in silver and gold, and I love them so much. The very last but not least thing that I'd like to mention um, would be a handbag. Um, I've done a full review on this bag, and this is the Lily Jade Madeline bag in Brandy. Um, this is an absolute amazing gift for a mom because it's not only a gorgeous leather handbag, genuine leather, but it's also a diaper bag. And if you've seen my review of this bag, you'll know that the interior of the bag is a beautiful jade color and it has a insert. So you can put all of your baby items in this insert, you can pop it out and then hand it to your childcare provider, whether it's grandma, grandpa, your spouse, so you can hand this to them and then you can walk out the door with your gorgeous leather handbag just that easily. I love it so much. I think it would make an amazing gift for Mother's Day. And um, what woman doesn't love a gorgeous leather handbag? I know I do. So that is it for the video today, guys. If you enjoyed it and found it helpful, definitely give it a big thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I want to make a mention that I know that Mother's Day is not always the easiest day for some folks, whether you've lost a mother or whether you're trying to become a mother and maybe struggling with fertility issues, I know that it might not always be the happiest of days. And I want each and every one of you guys to know that my heart and my prayers are with all of you and that I hope that you have an amazing Mother's Day and that you're able to celebrate your mother, whether she's here or whether she's not. And I just want to send out my hugs, my prayers, and my love to every single one of you this Mother's Day.